It's all about another one. How are we doing, guys? So tonight we're on something. Double check the audio. Yeah, we're good. Sorry, checking the audio first. Uh, so tonight we are on Peroni Nastro Azuro. Every single person in the world has had Peroni at some point, haven't they? Surely. It's everywhere. Absolutely fucking everywhere. Every single shop in the universe near enough sells it, right? It's not like it's some fucking hard to do, difficult lager to get hold of. I've had plenty of it in my time, and you know it's it's sold all over. Plenty of people seem to like it, but the end, plenty of people like Fosters and not shite. So, Peroni Nastro Azuro Italiana, brewed and bottled. In Italy, by Beer of Peroni for Asahi Red. It's actually fucking from Italy. 5%. This is a big bottle. I got this from Boots. Wasn't much, about two quid or something. Maybe not even that. <coughs> it's good till April next year. So there's plenty of time on it. It's nicely chilled. Let's get into the bottle. Get into the glass, shall we? See what it's like. Well, there's a bottle cap if anybody's interested. Let's get into a glass now and see what it looks like, shall we? It's a bit lively. There you go, it's lovely sort of golden in colour. Just looks like a this sort of widget in it, and it's fox egg. Look at that, it's going crackers. That is a... F oh, dear. I didn't realise there's a widget in it, can you see there? It's going bonkers. So, um, anyway, it's a lovely sort of golden colour. Plenty of carbonation, but that's due to the glass, because I'm an idiot. Let's have a whiff. There's a bit of citrus in this going on, actually. Go on, back into fucking... There we go. There's a bit of citrus going on. A bit of lemon. A bit of lime. There's like a sweet, sweet maltiness there as well. It smells alright, man. Man, and then it smells alright, man. It smells alright. It smells like a decent sort of supermarket lager, you know. It's better than some of the other shit I've had. It's better than like. Fosters and Carlsberg and Carling and that shite. Just didn't realise there's a widget in it, so the head's gone absolutely ridiculous. Let's see if we can get stuck into this, see if we can get some flavour out of it, shall we? Cheers. I'll tell you what. It's crisp, it's smooth, it's very easy drinking. There is that sort of sweetness there, that slightly sort of lemony, malty sweetness. There's an ever so slight bitterness as well, ever so slight it's on the back end. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's not going to blow you away. You know, it's no... It's no Hofbrau or fucking Veltins or Lowenbrau or Spartan or anything like that. But as far as the supermarket lagers go, it's not bad. It's all right. It does the job. You could drink plenty. You know, if you went out and about, if that's what you're into, you could drink a few of them, no problem at all. doesn't really taste much, you know, but it's all right. It's... It's just like a sort of malt, slightly malty sweet with a slight bit of citrus to it. And that's my alarm telling me my grub's ready. Uh, it's all right. No special, just. It hits a spot. You know, it's first bit of the night. It hits the spot. Probably wouldn't go out and buy it again, but you live and learn. 
I drink it over, you know, I drink it over most of you with the macro shite. So I guess that's something. It's all right, man. Peroni. It's all right. It's not amazing. It's not going to blow you away. It's perfectly drinkable, though. You know, it's not, it's not terrible. It's not shocking. It's just, it's just all right. Yeah. You know, I, I wouldn't rush out to drink it again, but I'd have it again. Yeah, it's not, it's not terrible. It's just all right. Just, you know. It's just got a bit more flavour than most of you other super cheap lagers. Middle of the road for me, yeah. As I said again, middle of the road. Very average, nothing special. Probably wouldn't buy it again in a hurry, but, you know, you live and learn. So... That'll be it then. I'll wrap it up and we'll have my tea. Thank you for watching, guys. You've been awesome. We are on 603 subscribers. If you've not already, please hit that subscribe button. Ding dong that bell. Drop the video a like. And I'll catch you next time. Peace. Ah.